but I... I'm confused. It's also true that your actions saved the lives of others. You never know. Someday I might turn my blade on you. You'd never do something like that without a reason. If you ever end up pointing your sword at me, I'm sure I will have done something to deserve it. <sighs> if you're going to go with Flynn, now's your chance. He seemed like he was in a hurry. No. I'm gonna continue on this journey with you. It's what I want. Traveling with you, I know I'll find the right path for myself, too. So what I'm thinking is... Here's to the road ahead. Thanks. Sawed logs like that for a good long while. Ugh. Yeah, it's called oversleeping. We're ready to hit the road, so get that sleep out of your eyes. Hey, old man, your eyes are all droopy. What? That's not good. Jeez. Huh? There are fewer knights than before. Yeah, Flynn and his crew went back to Nordopolica. That must mean they were traveling by night. Was there some emergency they had to deal with? They wanted to eat some fish, so they went back to Nordopolica. Oh, come on, Patty. They're not like you. Maybe they had to take care of the monsters from the Colosseum. I'll bet Paul Estrale requested the help of the knights. Hmm. We'll have to wait and see. Hmm? Well, it's just that Flynn said something about a barricade. Barricade? What could that mean? Are they out to arrest Bellius for what happened in the Great War? I can't imagine that Paul Estrale would be outmaneuvered that easily by the Knights. I get the feeling this is gonna get messy. Maybe we should think twice about heading back to Nordopolica for now. But the new moon's almost here. If we miss this chance, who knows when we might meet Bellius again? If I can't go to Nordopolica, I can't get on a ship. If I don't get on a ship, I won't be able to find the Maristella or recover my memory. That's all well and good. I'm just not in a hurry to get tangled up with that armor-wearing bunch. Me neither. We'll just have to be careful, like always. No use panicking about it. Don't forget, I want to take a look at the air crane and Kados. Don't worry, I haven't forgotten. All right, let's head out. here in Mantake, now that Flynn's liberated the town. They did allow the ringleader to escape, though. Kimor? Flynn will catch him in no time, right, Yuri? Hmm. Oh, yeah, sure he will. Is something wrong? He looked troubled. Estelle's not her usual perky self, either. Th that's not true. I'm as happy as you all are that Mantake's been freed. If you say so.
good day. Ah, are you going to the Weasand of Kados? Yes, we are. Why do you ask? The Imperial Knights have sealed off passage through Kados. It's not just here. They've set up blockades at all of the routes through the mountains. Blockades? Why would they... I don't know all the details, but I heard that it has something to do with some danger in Nordopolica. What should we do? We need to get to Nordopolica before the new moon. I wish I could help, but they wouldn't even let me through, and I have a travel permit. Are you a member of the Fortune's Market? Yes. How'd you get your permit? The Empire issues travel permits to Fortune's Market so that its members can travel wherever they want. At least, that's how it's supposed to be. Right. But the Imperial Knights wouldn't let me go any further. I'm going back to Mantake, since there's no way to get around them. Should we go back to Mantake and chill out too? Hmm. What are we gonna do? Do you think Flynn ordered the blockades? Hmm. I couldn't say. Either way, we can't afford to be stuck here for much longer. Yes. It'll be a lot of trouble if we miss the new moon. But I don't think they'd let us through, even if we asked nicely. Well, to be honest, we can go take a look and think about how to get in. What do you mean, once we've gotten inside? They set up blockades to make it hard to get out of the mountains. I think that much is safe to assume. Well then, should we go back to Mantake to do some final preparations? No, we're fine. Let's go like we are. Wow, the days just fly by. What's with you all of a sudden? Oh, I've just been thinking about how strong we've grown without even realizing it. That's because we have terrible luck. What does getting stronger have to do with having bad luck? We keep running into one mess after another. The Empire, the Guilds, everybody hates us. So all this bad luck made us fight, and so we got stronger. Is that really luck? It's all right, Carol. As we travel, the winds of luck are little by little turning in our favor. Exactly. Luck just flies by too, like the wind. Yuri, you're kind of missing the point. The Flynn Brigade. So that's the blockade? Yeah. Looks like it was Flynn's brigade's doing after all, but... What are those monsters doing here? Perhaps they've been tamed by the knights? This brigade is reminding me of Flynn less and less. What the hell is Flynn doing with his knights anyway? With hardcore tactics like this, there ain't any doubt in my mind this has something to do with the talk of Bellius engineering the Great War. So how do we get past this checkpoint? Huh? Seriously? Let's do that. And then? What could they be talking about? Old man, do you mind keeping it down? Sorry, sorry. Now that sounds like fun. How about this? What the hell? Stop it, settle down. Let's go now. Hey, hey, don't leave this old man behind. What the? Come back, you! Yuri Lowell! See ya! Have fun! That was pretty slick, old man. What are you saying? That was all thanks to Patty. Humans work a lot harder when they get rewarded, don't they? Rewarded? What are you talking about? That's our little secret. It's just between us, right, Patty? So annoying. It's our little secret. What is that nonsense? It's probably some useless promise of theirs. Anyway, let's keep moving. Your friend is quite talented, considering the ease with which he saved Mantake. Who, Flynn? That was nothing for him. You know him really well, don't you, Yuri? Well, we've hung around together since we were kids. You don't hang around together much anymore, though. <sighs> Yuri?
Gone soon enough. I'm just getting started. I'm not done. I just keep. We got a head start. This ain't a bad strategy either. Only the Empire has enough power to cut off all the ways in and out of a whole town. Well, the Guild's power is totally different. The Union would never try something like this. It's the Empire's style, crush problems with everything they've got. What are they after? 
Who do they think they are, sealing off all the roads like this? I think the answer to that lies in Nordopolica. We should hurry before we're caught. us that was pretty fun hey this is no game seriously now that's what i'm talking about combining patty's brain with my technique two heads are better than one yeah but they went and sealed off a dangerous place like this just to isolate nordopolica these guys mean business seriously even bringing monsters to help whatever they're doing it can't be good I can't believe that Flynn would order something like this. Hey, what kind of person is Flynn? He's Yuri's friend. I've heard they've known each other since they were children. Sometimes orders coming down from the top don't make sense. The meaning can get lost going down the chain of command. When a brigade gets big and famous enough, things can start to get out of hand. You certainly know a lot about these things. It makes sense for someone in Altosk. Things can end up like that, no matter what the organization. What worries me is how much of a hand Flynn had in all this. I'm sure we'll get a good understanding of that as soon as we can get to Nordopolica. That's right. But we should be on our guard. Even though I find it hard to believe that they've conquered Nordopolica by force. Yeah, I think the Palastrale would have a problem with that. Sorry, Rita. You won't get much time to investigate the Air Krenne. Oh well. I don't have much choice. It'd be bad if they caught up to us. Exactly. Come on, let's get going. Yuri sure is enthusiastic. He won't say it, but I reckon he's just worried about his friend.
Do Flynn and Yuri really have that strong of a bond? Hmm. Well, you could call it strong, I guess. Maybe. What? Are you jealous? Hmm. I'll have to hold a strategic meeting to stop Yuri from being snatched away from me. So what was that deal you were talking about? A deal? What sort of deal? With who? You said something about a deal with the old man when we were in Kados. I... Don't tell me you forgot. Uh, no. I haven't forgotten. She forgot. So it's a secret, is it? I'll tell you, Yuri. Since I can trust you. I appreciate it. If he works hard here, I'll teach him Judy's measurements. You really know how his mind works, don't you? It's not exactly a mystery. Hmm? What's up? Shouldn't we be hurrying along? Hey, you're not as young as you used to be. Let's take it easy. Seconded! Well, well, what do you mean? Let's go.
That's what happens when I get s No time to think. Just beat him senseless and you'll win. Try not to take too long, okay? Sure. It's completely inactive now, and it was overflowing so much before. Is that how the air was controlled? Is that air crene safe now? We'll be in trouble if air shoots out of it like before. It doesn't look like you have to worry about that. So why'd the air suddenly shoot out before? That's what's puzzling me. Maybe it was just a natural phenomenon? The probability of that is low at best. If that was the case, it should be emitting air at regular intervals. If air were emitted that frequently, it'd have an effect on the environment. Like how the plants grew so unnaturally in Cave Mock. Looks pretty normal around here to me. So perhaps something else interfered with the air crene and caused it to discharge air? What could do that? Only a formula or blastia could affect air like that. <laughs> Damn, that would be our fan club. Seems like these knights are just as dedicated as the captain himself. Rita, let's go. Are you done looking at the air crane? Just let me think a little more. If you just need time to think, you'll have plenty of time once we've gotten out of here. Mmm, all right, all right. If the air crane was disturbed by... Did you figure anything out? It's still too early to say. I've got some leads, but it's nothing I can be sure of yet. Well, make sure and let us know when you've nailed it down. I will. All right, let's head out. And it'll probably involve you. Who's next? Who's next? 
Gone soon enough. secret of your strength I don't know maybe I just have fun fighting cool I'll do that too oh I feel so powerful take cover huh guess it's only natural they're guarding this end too Patty do you have any ideas for getting through hmm Raven, can you do something like you did before? Best not to press your luck when the knights are taking their work so seriously. They don't look that serious from here. I say, woe is me! How has our illustrious Schwan Brigade ever been reduced to playing backup for Flynn? Enough complaining. If you don't like it, we better produce some results. There they are! Capture them! They found us! What is this? You three, don't let him escape! Ah, if it isn't Mr. Yuri Lowell! Hey, LeBlanc, it's been a while. Uh, and your highness! What are we gonna do? 
Oh well. Here goes nothing. Wait! Attention! Y yes sir! Not sure what's going on, but now's our chance. Huh? Raven, what did you do? Ah, it's nothing. Enough standing around. They'll catch up in no time if we don't get moving. We can't miss this chance. Yeah, let's head for North...